Ladies and gentlemen, here we are, fight number nine. Um, barbecue fight night, 18th of August, Craig Thompson Promotions. Fight nine, we've got Caleb Taylor versus Wayne Dill. I'm Kerry Davis, I'm here with Chris Smiling. Good evening. supporters here. You can see the response from the crowd. Oh, look at him come down. Look. Oh, he's, loving he's ready it. to go. He's loving it. He needs a rock star tonight. That's a game. You can see, you can see when they're walking into the ring what the resolve is like. He looks, he looks like he's loving it. He wants to be here. The crowd are up on their feet. Craig Thompson in his corner. I think we've got a situation here where the, uh, the ball guard is not in place again, so we've got to... Oh, another guy forgot to put their groin guard on. I think I put it over the top of the shorts. I remember doing that once, Chris, and you had to fix it for me when I put my shorts on that time, and you uh, had to put the groin guard on. <laughs> oh, no, what I, I, I put my gloves on first, that was it, wasn't it? All part of, all part of coaching, all part of... Uh, this guy's doing it in the ring. <laughs> He's not sure. He's not sure. <laughs> He's in the Good to go now. Then the announcers are the ticket. Thank 
Corner hasn't got a tucked in either, but let's hope he's wearing his green guard. Well, we'll find out. So, again, one of these guys are opting to wear for the headgear and the other one not. Um, but his corporate fights it is optional, so it's completely down to the fighter. The right hand's coming. Oh! And he went straight back. Put his hands up. ABC, special this level. Oh. So Caleb there, just walking onto a couple of right hands early on. Seems a little bit hesitant. Oh. Well, you can see that, that right hand's going to work for him tonight. He's going to be... Uh... I said, just getting back onto his jab. As we were talking about earlier, Chris, the jab's not a punch to be neglected, you know. Um, a lot of, everything works off that jab. Absolutely. And, um, and then the right hand follows. of round one. So guys at home, this fight number nine is actually a uh, fight to raise money for um, a big barbecue tournament happening over in the States. Um, so yeah, going for a good cause. Here we go, ready for round two. So a very even first round. up a little bit now. Whoa, big right hand there from Blue Corner, big right hand. Oh, he's really wearing those right hands. Yeah, yes, he definitely needs to definitely needs to keep that left hand up. Even even move away from that right hand. Yeah. Move, move to his right. That's the money shot, isn't it? He just keeps coming that right hand over the top. Finish that round with a big flurry. End of round two. Another even match. Both guys go back to the corner looking a little bit um, bit exhausted here now, Chris. So see who's got anything left in the tank for the third round. Craig Thompson here in the blue corner giving his man a bit of a pep talk here to uh, 
see if he changes his tactics for the last round. He seems to be landing that right hand quite often. So um, will he be telling him? Will he be telling more of the same, Chris, or uh, what would you be telling their blue corner for this final round? Yeah, just keep doing what you're doing, but just do more of it. Just, just get busy and let it go. Empty the tank this round. Work off that jab, maybe that jab will help set it up first. And let's see if Red Corner becomes wise to that right hand. He's getting tagged with it a lot early on, so let's see if he decides to move his head or keep that left hand a little yeah, bit higher. Oh, there it is, there it is. Big looping right oh. hand. Oh, Red Corner, he turns his back there. Cardinal Sin, Chris, you can't be turning your back on your opponent. No. Just, yeah. just, just mobbers mistakes. Actually a legal move, but um, definitely for his own safety, he wants to keep his eyes on his opponent at all times. Yes. Absolutely. Yeah, the last 30, time to empty the tank Oh, here. certainly, let's see who wants it the most, Chris. Empty the tank, oh, that's it. beautiful that's jab it. from Red, lovely jab. Oh, tries to fight out the pinch. Empty the tank, empty the tank. Keep oh. those hands up. There it is, there it is. Yeah, good finish to the fight. There we go. Tied. Good effort, good effort. Another good, another even another, match. Another even match. Another even yes. match. Once again, we're going to see the favouring, the, the heavier shots landed. That's probably where it could go. Both fighters there looking exhausted. That's what you like to see. They've emptied the tank and give it all. Going on decision. Oh, oh made the decision go. again. I'd say, I'd say this would swing Blue's way, wouldn't you, Kerry? Oh, just for those eye-catching right hands over the top, yep, but you never know. It's very close. Yeah, he's gone blue, yep. Both of, the, both of them will leave that ring happy men, I'd say. Very close fight. They should be both very proud of themselves. Yeah. And um, they say doing it for a good cause. He looks, looks very relieved. He looks, looks relieved he's done it. Good on him. It's not an easy thing to do. It's like everything you're doing, training. Yeah, take it to the ring and kind of all just goes out the window, but... Right. I hear that. Did, did you get to do a couple of things? Did you have Did you practice that overhand right? Yeah, I did. I did. Did you evade a few punches? Yeah. That's the main yeah. thing. Got in there for a good cause. What are you supporting? Uh, we're going to uh, the Kansas City World Series of Barbecue World Champs. And uh, so after winning the national title, we're off to cook some wicked Kiwi barbecue, bro. That's the one. After this, everything's going to be easy. It's going to be awesome, man. That's the one. Good luck. Nice Thanks, work, bro. man. Thank you.